So what mixed reality is, is a combination of three key trends. So one of them is virtual reality, which was really big in 2016, augmented reality, which is an emerging trend, and also the internet of things. So when you combine all three of those technologies together, what you get is mixed reality. So what does all that mean? So you may have tried out um, virtual reality and you've seen it's an immersive experience, but you can't see outside of it. Um, with augmented reality, what you can see is a real world with some other information applied on top of it. And with the Internet of Things, what you get is a lot of data, um, but it's hard to visualize it. So when you have mixed reality, you combine all of those trends together in one application. 2017, mixed reality is still in its early stages. Um, right now, there is a lot of experimentation uh, which is happening, and so we're looking at where it may actually be applicable. Um, where we think mixed reality will work um, includes a lot of industrial settings. That's where a lot of the Internet of Things development is really happening. Uh, it's about understanding what is happening with machinery, with parts, with assembly lines. Um, and mixed reality will help understand um, what is happening um, in terms of the quantity and quality of flow, th say, through on an assembly line. Um, but also it can help a lot with um, problem solving. So the ability to see instructional manuals uh, in front of you as opposed to having to refer to them is always going to be a great thing to do. A key consideration with any technology, mixed reality or otherwise, is having the right policies and controls in place. So understanding who is using the technology, uh, for what ends, um, where it's being used internally as well as externally is always going to be uh, very important. And understanding who's got control of which of the devices um, is going to be of paramount importance. Understanding um, what is being shown is also vital. Uh, we're in an era where content can be uh, faked uh, very easily, whether it's news or anything else, uh, and what people are being shown may look very realistic, but it may not be authentic, and making sure that the files are all genuine is going to be of paramount importance. With mixed reality, the most important thing to do is to try it out. So um, perhaps before you try it out, um, go to um, meet with some companies which are creating the technology. Um, use it for more than just five minutes. Use it for a few hours. Try it with a range of different people, a range of different applications, so you can understand what is possible today, uh, but also what is difficult to do. So mixed reality um, is a fantastic technology with a lot of potential, um, but also it has its limitations too, and they cannot be um, overlooked. So um, understand all the different uh, groups within your company which need to be making this work. Um, find out all the different stakeholders um, who are there uh, and make sure that you bring them along uh, with a journey towards mixed reality.